people out there in the world this is rant of the week this week we'll start off with a few announcements first i'd like to give a shout out to my lovely partner Gemma. she streams on twitch almost every night she please feel free to go check her out her username is inland lightning also an amazing friend of ours kelly also streams on twitch every day she is C for Cali on Twitch. Also, I'd like to give a shout out to some old friends out there. You know who you are. This week in the news, Michael Jackson. There's been a documentary. Yes, another documentary. And yes, he's been accused of being a pedophile again. The guy has been accused of being a pedophile more times than I've changed my socks. And I change my socks daily. So, is he, isn't he? Does it really matter? He's dead. He's been dead for 10 years. Do we really, really need to run his, run his name through the mud anymore through a documentary? No. Yes, if he has victims out there, the victims need help and things like that. But does it really matter to the rest of us? No, it doesn't. So, HBO, screw you. Get back in your cage! Now, my dog, as you know, can be very naughty at times. At the moment, it's been a bit wet and windy in the UK. So, yesterday, my dog decided that he didn't want to stand out there in the cold and the rain. And the rain? <laughs> stand out there in the cold and rain. So, my partner said to him, You done, Twin? You want to come in? He runs in, she pops up the shop, and all of a sudden I smell this terrible smell. I look in the hallway, and the dog has done the biggest turd you can imagine. I can't find this dog anywhere. This dog knows he's done wrong. Mate, I found him hiding behind the sofa. He knew he'd done wrong. But I'll tell you what, that dog has not made a peep since. He was banned from the bed. He was banned from treats. He, he has absolutely been a diamond sense. So, I have told him that if he carries on, he's going to get a cage and he's going to sleep in a cage. Because if you can't be trusted in a house, you can sleep in a cage. So, if you shit in my hallway, guess what? You get back in your cage! I've been suffering from insomnia quite a bit lately. I find it really, really hard to fall asleep. Sometimes I'll go in, go into bed and I'll just be sparko straight away. Other times it can come five, six, seven o'clock, eight o'clock in the morning even. Sometimes even pushing nine and I just lay there and I lay there and I just cannot switch off and I cannot sleep. And then... I'll fall asleep eventually, but like for one, two hours. So I don't, I've been really, really suffering from that. But one thing doing this, I've noticed. Why the hell does the TV volume go so loud at three, four o'clock in the morning? Even up to about five. It, it literally just goes so loud. And they're like, oh no, it's because everything else is so quiet. That's why it seems loud. Because I've Googled this. Bollocks is it? The volume at 7 o'clock, you can hardly hear. You've got to turn it up. So, are you telling me that 7 o'clock is louder than 4 o'clock in the morning? I don't think so. I just think they put it... I think they put the volume up to annoy people. To wake them up to watch their shows. I really do. <laughs> that brings me to my next point. People on Facebook. How thick can they be i sold the tv on facebook i literally whacked it on facebook within a minute i got a response and i said and the guy's like oh yeah i want the tv i want the tv like, but i've got no stand i but um i had put on that it had no stand Walmart came with it the guy's like no 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 like yeah yeah i want it i'm all right, I'm all right. 
And then, like, five minutes later, I got a message of, oh, sorry, I don't want it. I just saw it. It had no stand. I didn't see that. I'm like, it was in bold caps in the advert. No stand. Lucky for this guy, I actually found the stand and he did come collect it. But after I put on the ads that it had been sold, everything, made sure I put I put it in the description and the ad just so people didn't get confused. I had five people message me three hours after I've put this up as sold. Is it still available? I just messaged back saying, maybe you need to go to Specsavers and learn how to read. It's sold! Get in your cage! Now, one of the most annoying things in the universe is annoying songs. There's been loads over the years, but I think one of the newest and most annoying songs ever is Baby Shark. People fucking dance out their cars. Do you know how many accidents have been caused by Baby Shark? People trying to drive down the road and dance out their cars and sing and do some sort of... What the hell? It's like, big box, little box, car, box, box. No. Big fish, little fish, car, box, box. You know what I mean? Like, what the hell? Are we all turn into toddlers? The other thing is, people that ignore you. Oh, mate. You can turn around and speak to someone that you think they're listening. Because they turn around and ask you a question and you answer it back. And then... You go off, you explain something, you go into detail, you, you like, oh, do you understand that? And they're like, well, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. So you've just explained everything that they wanted to know in a question. Or they'll ask you the same question an hour later and say, like, they never asked you. It's like, just proves you do not pay attention to a word I say. So you know what I say to that? Get back in your cage! We're up to 75 subscribers now. Absolutely amazing. I mean, the heart, I feel heartwarmed from all, everyone who you subscribe. If you haven't subscribed and you're watching these videos, please, please, please do. Also, feel free to like, like, comment, and share with your friends. And this has been Rent of the Week!